Sauron will use his puppet Saruman to destroy the people of Rohan. Isengard has been unleashed. Okay, everyone, they're actually on the move right now. As you can see, the timer it is actually very nearly uh, down, so... Yeah, they actually decided to enter the last minute uh, to do a charge, it would appear. Now, they actually, uh, before I could record, they actually charged my, uh, my, uh, Grasswomen, but my, uh, Spearman right there managed to take him out. Here we go. Take him out. This shouldn't be that difficult. There, here come their cab as well. But again, this should not be that bad. The majority of their forces are indeed wavering due to the loss of their general. That's fine, another cab unit, that's fine. My Spearman will take him out. Hopefully it will work out. If not, then, uh, yeah, sad times indeed. Okay, we got our route here. Hold the line, hold the line back up. Try and get my general in here. I should not have turned around. Get my general in there. Take out their cab. Bloody cab, I hate them so much. Oh, how I hate cavalry. Okay, they're pretty much shaken. They are dropping. Uh, their guys are dropping there as well. Unfortunately, though, my Urkai Raiders are weak as shit. They're absolutely terribly weak. Never seen such a weak unit. Hopefully, we should have the uh, beating of them here, though. Hopefully, that's indeed the plan. Again, we again we kind of have time on our side, kind of. They're gonna try and repeatedly uh, charge as well. Now we currently have some Rohan Raiders down to about ten men. Not bad. Our uh, Orc band are kind of holding the line here as well. They are dropping their scouts down. Unfortunately, we're losing a lot more men than they than they are. That's really a golfing quality of uh, the units that we start out with. It would appear that our uh, Zerkers are not doing too bad a job either. Our general is in the thick of it now as well. He should be also doing a good job. We'll rally as well, try and get their men out of there. Hopefully our men will not rout. And here I thought I'd get through this without too much loss in my own men's lives, but no, apparently it will indeed happen. They're just gonna try and repeatedly uh, charge in and out. There we go, we got a rout. Let's see now, can we get any more routing? Are they gone? No, they're not, but they'll be coming back. They will definitely be coming back. More Rohan Riders coming in. This will be painful if they decide to charge. They may not now, they may not. But they will invariably. Got my general right there. Help him out. Spearman, get in there. These guys, 45. They'll drop really quickly as well. Hopefully they will rout. We got another rout right there. Good stuff. We may actually have victory here, guys. That Erling Militia has gone. More Rohan Riders coming in. Take him out. Is that a rout? That's a good rout. Good stuff. Remember, if we somehow get lucky and take out the generals quickly, their armies invariably crumble. Get on to, uh, to speed. We killed about half of their army, that's the not bad. Badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. They'll drop. They'll drop really quick. God, that is absolutely painful. But then again, yes, they're routing as well. A lot of their units will come back though. That is a problem. Again, time is on our side. Hopefully we'll see a timer coming up now in a moment. Now we're currently getting shot at by their archers. Hit their militia, god damn it. There we go. Take as many prisoners as humanly possible. Force remains. Now we just need to hit their uh their Hemling gas. So more Rohan riders coming up here. Bloody calf. Bloody cavalry. Bane of my goddamn life. Okay, they're gone. Good stuff. And try and hit their archers, if at all possible. Oh, that's not good. Berserkers. They'll take a lot of uh, hits there. Yeah, they could actually go down. Try just take out that cav unit. These guys stand to drop now incredibly quickly. They still technically have their general though, so their morale will be a lot more uh, steady in the end. Good, we have a timer. Good stuff. 
Yeah, we're currently being shot at by uh, crossbowmen. Okay, they're down to about nine men. Where is their general? Their general's right there, actually. We can hit him. We can hopefully take him out. We have a couple of volleys left, but they have only six. So hopefully that can actually be doable. If we can just be accurate. That's all we need to be right now, is accurate. Which I don't think we actually are being right now. Given that, yeah, those shots are quite hard to make. In fact, we'll be killing more of their Hemlin gas than we will their uh, general. So yeah, that wasn't really ever going to work out. We will lose a Berserker unit, though. That's fine. We can get more. We can get more. Now hit the arches. And take out their bloody general. That time is going to run out, though. It'll be a win. The time for battle is over. Our Close victory. Well, yet we prevailed and earned ourselves a small victory. So we're horribly outnumbered, and we came out with a sort of a pyrrhic victory. It was really a battle I didn't expect to win, but I'm, you know, I'm happy enough that I did, and that was all really down to me. Corner camping. I would not have won otherwise. Their cavalry would have most definitely overwhelmed me at that point. So really, we had no choice but to uh, corner camp if we wanted to hold the uh, victory. It's all about victory. No place for honor in the battlefield. It's all about victory. Oh look, execute! Have mercy, my lord. Now our primary focus should be getting that guy back home. Retraining him, re-equipping him, giving him a new army. That has to be what we have to do. We have no choice, otherwise he will die. And this Morgul has been besieged by Gondor, no doubt. In fact, we can verify it right now. Actually, no, want to uh, trade. You have a proposition for us? Ah, uh, we have trade, good. Good day to you. It's fine with me. Yes. I cannot reach that place, my lord. So... Without question, my lord. Minas Morgul is right there, garrison of one unit. Hmm, very irresponsible by Mordor, if I do say so myself. Oh, dearie me. Currently have AK as well. It's actually proving quite, uh... It's actually proving quite profitable only holding Isengard at the moment, but then again... This right here is why we're making money. The second we take those units out, we start losing money, I feel. Let's get our men home. They can make it back. And hopefully we can retake the Fulberg without uh, too much uh, fuss. Which I actually think that that will actually be coming soon, you know. Re-equip uh, this fellow here with a decent force and we can take the Fulberg back. Now, oh, one more turn, Foundry will be done. We can also start re-equipping uh, these guys with superior Isengard steel. Hopefully it goes for all units, and not just units with plate on them. Ah, okay, they're not going to make it. Unless we can retreat, actually. What does he have? It's pro I think it's the remnants of the army I took out, but they've merged uh, together. I'm going to try and back it up. Back. Hopefully he we backs up quite back. fair. Can he make it? He can make it. I don't think we're going to get him home. We won't be able to win this. Not at all. We can try, but... I do not see us winning this. I mean, the Cav... Yeah, they have three full Cav. Although, the General's in an Archer unit. We wouldn't really be able to take him out right away. Not good, man. We're gonna have to try and fight to save this guy, I think. And we may have to corner camp again, let's go. Bloody Rohan, how much I hate them. Ah, Frodo saying goodbye to everyone. It's a really lovely picture. Right. Look, look to the hill. Look to the hill if there is one which there is. That there is actually right up here. We can look to that hill. Should help out. Yeah, we'll do that. Get everyone up here. Oh. That might be their general. Holy crap. Okay, take that out now. 
that 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 was lucky. Kill that right now. That has their goddamn general in it. Go kill it, go kill it, go kill it. Move, move, move. Go. Ah, oh, absolutely destroy that. Hopefully now if we're lucky we can get there quickly before their cab are upon us. And we can just take that out. I don't know what they're doing, but it's not good what it is they're doing. Ah, they're gonna try and fire. Get my men right there. Try and fire into them. No, if we do that we'll only end up hitting our own men. Okay, this is an archer unit. We're hitting them with uh, proper infantry. They should drop very quickly. I'm men like right there, maybe. No, they'll only end up going into a fight. That's fine. Just take them all out. They're a goddamn archer unit. They should not be holding. Come on. That army right there is on the move as well. Not not a good sign. Again, this is an archer unit. He should be dropping really quickly. Remember, we take out their general quickly enough then. You know. I'm optimistic about maybe winning. Let's get our men back there. Let's try and hold our back. T1. They lost a lot of their men. There comes their general. Right there. Majority of their force. Only half the enemy force remains. I don't, I don't think we're going to win this one. I'm not optimistic. Given that their uh, missile unit did quite well, again, I'm not very optimistic here. Bloody missile cav. God damn it. I think the general is right there too, and he is not dying. That is really annoying. Let's try and shoot them down. Erling Militia and, oh, they've gotten hidden. I don't know how they've gotten hidden. There is no cover for them to hide within. That's actually quite odd. I'm sorry, but these guys should not be allowed to fire. Come on. They're gonna charge? They're charging. Interesting tactic. Very interesting tactic. Even more interesting is that they're alive. That's actually very interesting. Yeah, they're just going to, uh... There we go. Finally took him out. Finally took him out. He should definitely rout now. He won't rout, though. That's quite obvious. Yep, here comes the cab spam. Bloody cavalry. And how that archer lived that long, I will never know. Hey, you know, if we can push him back, you know, that'd be great. <laughs> I don't see it happening, though. I do not see that happening. Okay, do we actually rode him? Or do we just tell him to fuck off? I think we just told him to fuck off. And he actually did. Very surprising. Yeah, we're not going to win this. Horribly outnumbered. With the battle. We're done. We killed how many? Killed about 130, maybe. 110, more like. 120? We didn't kill that much. So, from one uh, good battle to a bad battle. But again, we still need to consolidate properly. Come out with decent big-sized armies, and win. That's all we have to do. That's all we really can do. We have no choice. Which is why I really cannot wait for uh, my proper infantry to Retreat! come out. I think he might be alive. He's gonna hit the fort. And he's actually alive. We have to help him. They're attacking the camp! We have to help him. And we can help him. 
we have the men to do it. Thankfully, he didn't decide to attack right away. But yeah, we have backup. We can help him. I'm actually going to bring out a uh, good old... What's his face? Saruman, I think. <laughs> yeah, why not? Let's bring him out for the first time. Our baggage train had to be abandoned and was lost in a sketch report that the enemy has taken every single item we have to leave behind. Oh no, our treasury will indeed be hurt. Oh my. We got the foundry up though. That's good. Be gone. Listen up! My lord. Orders. Orders. Orcs! Get ready for fighting! Kill them all! We destroyed yeah, the enemy! Yeah, you've uh, done pissed off Saruman. You have Come done back. pissed off Saruman, Captain. One Erling Militia. Yeah, no, die. But my oh. And he has indeed been picked up. Objective so complete. nobody in their right mind is going to attack this army, in my opinion. Now, are we going to lose money from this? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we are. Well, actually, according to this, we're not. We're going to make a lot less, but we're not actually going to lose money. Now, this army may attack, but they will definitely die. Okay, well, the Minas Morgul uh, siege is ended. Maybe the army was repelled back, or maybe they gave up. I'm not actually too sure about that. I don't know what happened. But it would appear that all is not lost for Minas Morgul and Mordor. So Gondor will not be getting into Mordor from that route anytime soon. And really, they can't kill Saren anyway. I love these videos, and I know I'm going to get hit by copyright, but I don't care. To mute it would detract from the quality that I like to have. I'm willing to take the chance. I'm more than willing. Anyway, yeah, we have a lot to do, but that will be done in the next part. I shall see you then.